First, this new time, a firefighter being remembered after he died in the line of duty. John Davies became trapped after going back into a burning building to search for a man reported missing last week. Now, today, his family and hundreds of firefighters from around New England are in Worcester honoring his memory. Among them, dozens of firefighters from right here in Rhode Island. It's our top local story this noon time. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buto is bringing us the new details live in our newsroom. And as that fire in Worcester remains under investigation this morning, the local firefighters started leaving around dawn in shifts to remember and honor this fallen father of three. With John Davies' three sons serving as pallbearers, the 43-year-old, 17-year veteran was carried into Our Lady of Mount Carmel Church. I, John, saw a new heaven and a new earth. The former heaven and the former earth had passed away. Hours earlier, Rhode Island firefighters and police officers caravan to Worcester knowing firsthand why firefighter Davies put his life in danger. He was looking for a potentially trapped victim in this fire when the building collapsed. You get the news bits and pieces. First there's uh, a serious fire, then there's a collapse, then there might be a couple of guys missing. And, 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 and you kind of hope against hope till the end, that, until they finally to tell you that there is a, a line of duty death. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And I think the family appreciates it when they, uh, we have to put a brother down and uh, it's a sad occasion. Firefighters from all over the New England will attend this funeral today and it's very heart wrenching. The missing man was Ronald Robbins. He was found alive but now faces charges so far that are unrelated to that deadly fire. Live in the newsroom, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.